to today's lesson, people, Lucinda. Linda, I got your name there for a second. Welcome, happy Cinco de Mayo. Cinco de what? Is she talking about a condiment? So today's lesson, we are learning about camelids. Correct, if you think that the word camel is in that word, it is, because you are related to camels. I said it, you are related to a two-humped or one-humped thing. Did she just say that I am not unique? Oh, uh, excuse me, I'm a llama with a mustache. Have you ever seen that before? Girl, I know. Um, excuse me, we may look the same, but we are so different. Mmm. Okay, so technically you have five cousins. Count them five. Well, at least she knows how to count. That's one thing going for her. <sighs> Your first cousin who is the smallest, actually bigger than you guys because y'all tiny, <laughs> um, is called the Lamini. Rhymes with Martini. Get it? Martini? <laughs> y'all aren't laughing. Okay, we'll move on. Um, smallest of the llamas, just so you know. Tiny little thing. Have a picture here to show you. Right here, here, here. Somewhere. See? Okay. What the hell is that? Are you sure that's even an animal? It looks like something that should be eaten or something. I don't know. It's a disgrace if you ask me. Oh my god, that's even worse. What? That's the same thing? Oh my god. Where did these things even live? I've never seen any of these things in France. They don't even know how to get a true haircut. So your second cousins, your second cousins are Bicunas, not Mila Kunis. I can't even say that right? Bicunas. They're a little bit bigger than Laminis. Still cute, unlike y'all. Okay? And now we're going to look at pictures because y'all can't stand to look at me anymore, I know. So you're saying that this is different than the llama that you just showed us? I think you are lying, and you should not be teaching this class. Oh, hell no! Why are they looking at me? Uh-uh, turn around. Turn around. I know it's a picture, but I didn't give her permission to look at me. <laughs> oh, God, that's so funny. Oh, God. Somebody should fire the hairdresser because they forgot the spot. Your third cousin, yeah, you're looking at me again, is a guanaco. Like, guanapaco. Guana, yeah, I'm done with the jokes. Y'all are, okay. Uh, it's a little bit bigger. Still looks like a llama. I have the same facial expressions, I know. Okay, get with me. Y'all are dumb llamas, okay? We need to learn, okay? The COVID-19 stuff, you're out of school. Actually, they don't really have llama school. I'm rambling. Just focus, right here, right here, right here, right here, okay. Guanacos, picture, here, go! <laughs> you know what, Lucinda? I think she's just showing us the same picture over and over again, because I don't see a difference. Yes, um, so Linda pretty much just said everything I was thinking, so I'm just going to stay quiet on this one. What am I looking at here? Because I'm pretty sure I need to report it to HR, because I don't think I'm allowed to be seeing that. The alpaca is one of the most well-known of your species or family. I don't, I'm not a scientist, so I really don't even know why I'm teaching this class. <laughs> don't tell anybody. Um, I need the extra money because you know what? We all want to avoid. Um, alpacas kind of look like you guys, but are smaller in the face, cuter, you know? Not as long of a face as you guys have. You know, smaller muzzles, not as fluffy. I can be fluffy, depends if you're doing the haircut or not. They, they use them for blankets, you know, like I will do for you guys. And I will too. Just kidding. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we're gonna go to the next picture. Alright, here it is. Alpaca. Your family. Right here. Oh, yes! I know these people! Oh, yes, they are the ones that welcome me from the airport! Yes, they, they are your, they are related to you! They are related to me! That's such a coincidence! They are my cousins too! Oh, 
So it's like we are cousins. Two. Oh my gosh. We are cousins. Linda, we are cousins. Anyways, yes, this is my my brand cousin. Um Julio. The ones that you didn't know the name, so, so also is your cousin, but your best friend is the same time? Yes, this one? Yes. Uh, always, always very photogenic. Yes, yes, Vetti. Now that you have completed your llama training, I will now dub the real Latin llamas for Cinco de Mayo. Do you have any idea what she's doing right now? No, I do not. She's doing something weird with the stick. I know. I thought maybe it was like... Some weird, like, Cinco de Mayo thing. I dubbed the, you know what? If you cannot take this seriously. Oh, she just got mad. Oh. I, you, uh, just, you, I, you can go to the principal's office. Just because I am not a real teacher does not mean that I do not deserve respect. Oh, look, she just storming off. What is she taking off her shoe? Why did she just throw her shoes at us? Oh, oh, who's this? Oh, oh, this, this little girl, she's picking us up. Oh no, I've heard of this woman. She's the one who takes us to the principal's office. The principal's office? I have never been in trouble in my life. Well, we are both in trouble now. Well, 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 Linda and Lucinda, the two festive troublemaking llamas. This is all your fault. My fault? You let the human bring us here in the first place. Now I've been told that you haven't been paying attention in Miss Gabby's llama class. Let's just pretend like we're sorry. I will never bow down to a human, even if it means death. And I told him, why not throw a little pepperoni slice in your shoe? Give yourself a little pep in your step. <laughs> I tell you what. Was that supposed to be a joke? Cause the only thing funny around here is your face. <laughs> I don't know, I thought he was quite clever for a moment. <laughs> Wife's been acting kind of strange lately. Not too sure, she's been leaving every now and then, it's kind of late at night. Makes me wonder where she's going. Do you have any idea what he's saying? His sounds as crazy as the other human. Now you llamas make sure that you're doing right out there in the world. I don't want to have to see you in my office again. Now go on and run along, you crazy llamas. over here he's like I don't care what you're doing behind me I'm just gonna walk away he's like I'm not in your business and this one beside him he's like you know what let me follow you let me follow you out the door and the two up there they're like I'm gonna fight you I'm gonna fight you I'm gonna fight you you know it's like you know what it was like when I was in high school when those kids would get in a fight in the cafeteria and then everybody was like oh yeah fight 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 but you know me I was over at my table and I was like no nah, I'm out y'all I'm out I'm going class you know boom Done. What? What? Okay. This is big. This is big. That's what she said. <laughs> uh, Do you want to spank them? I'm getting this on video. I have a stick. No, I don't want to spank the llamas. It, it's huge. I, I've been told. Um. I don't feel so bad anymore. I'm not a bad actor. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Are you good? Yeah. Okay. Just kidding. Sorry. <laughs> it's your <laughs> Uh, Okay. So your second cousins are called Vicunias. I think I'm going to make a vagina joke. Sorry. <laughs>